Hello friends, it's me, and today, Mr. Beast 24 Hours Law of City. Let's check out spending 24 hours in the city with no laws from Mr. Beast. Together, let's go. Mm, let's start. Slab City is a community located in the middle of the desert. It has no electricity, no running water, and no law enforcement. Out of curiosity, me and the boys decided to spend 24 hours in the slabs. So we're getting close to Slab City, and as you see, there's roads and stuff, and then once we take this turn, it's nothing. No buildings, no nothing. So we're on the outskirts of Slab City. This right here is Salvation Mountain. It's a tourist attraction, and they recommend you don't go any further that way. It says keep out, Chandler. It says, ah, I guess there's no laws. So we're at the top of Candy Mountain, and uh, Slab City is that way a little bit more. <laughs> and uh, yeah, guys. So we discovered this cave, and it has art on the walls. I'm not doing it. I'm not going in. Chandler, go in. Go in. Go in. Go. Chandler. This looks like something out of a horror video game. I know. 100%. Ooh, what's in here? I don't, dude, that's, I don't want to go in there. Nope, nope, nope. We're not going in there. Oh, this is incredible. Look at it. Look up, guys. Just look up. I have so many questions about how all this got here. Like, we're literally in the middle of a desert. So we're at the info thing for Slap City, the last free place on earth. That's meme error dot E-N no D. It's oh, it's Chris. Chris. Look. Oh, Chris. Well, here's FedEx delivering to? That's what I want to know. Uh, I think we should go now, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah it's kind of creepy. Here, you go. Here. Here. Don't. Mm -hmm. Oh. Not, 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 at least not. Um, I'm not going in there. Yeah, Garrett, you have fun. I'm going back to the car. What is this? It's Winnie the Pooh oh, wow. on a grave. That was a bad movie anyways. I don't know where we're going. I'm just scared something's gonna jump out of me at any second. Dude, this is very, this is very scary. Like, yeah, let's get out of here. I'm done. Oh, we're moving on. Oh, hey Garrett, creepy. look, it's that's, you. That's creepy. Oh, oh. Right. Does actually look like Garrett. Okay. All right, hey, Terry, fly a drone over that so we can see what's in it. Okay. Next we're going- Wow, the drone shot. And also, three hours in. Mm. Going to an art museum owned by this guy named The Wizard in the middle of a desert with no laws. And we have three rules. One, you don't have to stay in the carpeting. Two, everything is touchable. Three, you touch it and it breaks. Tell them it was broken you got here. <laughs> okay. right. Bowl in the bowling alley. All we asked, you put the pins back. We've been homicide free for three days. We're shooting for a week. <laughs> All, right. All right, Chris. You guys are doing seesaw? Yes, sir. This is the seesaw. Oh, wait a minute. It just released it into my brain. It's like, wait, what? All we asked, you put the pins back. We've been homicide free for three days. We're shooting for a week. All right, <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, Chris. You guys are doing seesaw? Yes, sir. This is the seesaw here. I don't think I'm tall enough. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this. <laughs> it goes scary. I've been on scary rides in like Woo! amusement parks, <laughs> but I've also had straps on those scary rides, Chris. You don't need straps in life, man. Hey. Don't get down yet, Gary. No, I, I want to get down. Force no, you. I go. <laughs> I thought I was gonna die. Not gonna lie, it was not fun. I lost my shirt because you don't need clothes in Slab City. I'm Slab. All right, knowing the future. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Guys, they got memes in here. Hyperstension, stress, Christmas. Yes. <laughs> Come to the desert if you want fire memes. It's dangerous. First one to use the bathroom gets 10 grand. Hi. Wait, what? That's Christmas. Yes. Uh-huh. Come to the desert if you want fire memes. It's dangerous. First one to use the bathroom gets 10 grand. I don't like that toilet bowl. Sorry. Hi. He's a good boy. <laughs> Gear get. It's an elephant. It's a cage full of Spider-Man. They're free range. They look discolored. Have Jimmy walk in the middle of that room and we're all gonna hide behind a door. I'm in a room full of doors and they're all hiding behind a random door. If I pick the door they're hiding behind, they owe me a grand. Uh, I don't know uh, what door I opened. I'm just gonna close that one. I guess we'll try this oh. one. 
Can I have my thousand dollars? Hey, boys. <laughs> it's like, no, wait, wait, wait. Yes. Go down the scary tunnel first so I don't die. Beat my shield, Chandler. Hey guys, what the heck are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Chill, you, you jumped so hard. It's got a bunch of kazoos in it. You won't blow one. Please don't please. Chill, chill. Chris, 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 chill. Chris. This is where the outbreak starts. <laughs> so Chris, what do you think of this place so far? Ooh, too soon bro, too soon. Literally too soon. This video came out in the year 2019. In 2020, COVID-19, global pandemic. Mm -hmm. I think I want to live here. It's beautiful and it's art. Wait, hold on, one more thing. They've got a lot of bowling balls, but not enough water. Sugar, what do you think of this place so far? No. What do, what do you mean? No. Okay. Same hey, level. so Chandler, what's uh, what do you think of this place so far? Chan. What? So Chris. Yeah, what's up, man? This seems a little familiar here. Uh, did this happen before? Yeah. What happened? What's happening here? That was back in the desert, right? So Chris here used to be a Boy Scout. Yes, sir. He used to do this Chris all the time. Chris is the only reason we're going to survive this challenge. Chris, can you heat this up for me? Yeah, hold on. I'm hungry. Hold on. Chris, busy. what do these steaks mean? Cheese butt, come here. Don't call me cheese butt, I'm not doing it. I got to be honest with you, if I have teammates like this, I'll be very pissed off. <laughs> because case in point, I mentioned this before, there was this time we were in Polytechnics and our seniors uh, show us how to set a tent, a tent from nothing, from scratch. That means outside the box. <laughs> Within like 90 seconds, I guess. And then they challenge us, our team, a team of like 10 people, 8 people, to complete the same thing within 2 minutes, 120 seconds. And then knowing our seniors, 3 people, 3 or 4 people, complete it within 90 seconds, we complete it within 30 to 40 seconds. That's a lot. But we did it together. So it's like one, two, three, up. One, two, three, top. One, two, three, good. All right, we're set. It's like, whoa, that's fast. But in this case, it's only one man job. One woman job. He called you cheese, but guys, right. we don't need Chris. Let's figure it out. Yeah. All right, you heard it. Remember what happened last time you said that? <laughs> yeah, he Come helped on, us do it so. together. So what's, what's your plan with this uh, Garrett here? Efficiency matters a lot. How are you gonna do this tent? Um, Chris? There's no I in slab, Chris. When you guys buy merch, use code Chris. I like that a lot. Yeah. yeah. Like I said in that one Twitch video, whenever you check out at Shop Mr. Beast, if you put in one of their codes, they get a little kickback. Here, let me help you with that. <laughs> the easiest part. <laughs> Man, I love Chris. He just does everything. I'm just sick of everybody relying on me for everything. Ow. Don't go Chris, in my tent. Thank you for letting me stay. No, in tent. get out of my tent. Get out of your your shoes are on. Don't put your shoes in that. Shoes off, shoes uh, off, shoes off. Stand up your tent or make food. So which one do you want? Can, you stand in front Can of I just give you a thousand dollars to do both? You heard it folks. There we go. It's out of there. Yeah, I'd rather not be recognized in Slab City. <laughs> I am just a tourist. Chandler, there's no McDonald's out here. Oh, you're the king of YouTube. You being just a tourist is a big scratch. It's the stretching it. So when are we leaving? There's no McDonald's out here? They told me there was restaurants. They lied to me. Chris, make the food. Might not get any food at all. Is there Uber Eats out here? Wait, you wanna give me your? Yeah. This yeah. happened last time. Yeah. Why does this keep happening? No, I think it's at Walmart. Is that Walmart? <laughs> <laughs> so what's going on here? Walmart sucks. Chris said he was an so, expert. He uh, lied. <laughs> well, you just got demerited. Oh, okay. All right, figure this out then. We did. It doesn't work. <laughs> this does not fit in here, so Walmart lied to us. So are we going to have to just make our own fire? Or we could ask locals for food. Um, yes, we're going to have to make our own fire. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's job is to get big sticks. So my job is to get big rocks. Me and Chandler will get rocks, you and Garrett get sticks. Why'd you guys pick rocks over sticks? Sticks are pokey. All right, so you're getting some stickers? Yeah, we're getting some sticks. I'm sick and I have to do everything and it's not very fair. Thank you, Chris. Did you just spill all the matches? Yeah. Remember, I am sick. 
Chandler, can you go away? You literally have no construction. He told me to come over here and say dumb things. You got a couple on the ground. <laughs> I see that, buddy. <laughs> oh, do we have him working? Yeah. 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 Oh, no. No, I just want to give you guys a heads up on good stuff. Oh, okay. yes, sir. Okay, you know about the show tonight. No, no. Oh, there's no, a show? show. Every Saturday night at sundown. Open mic, live music, BYOB. Anybody skateboard? Did you I didn't bring my skateboard. You... I didn't. Anything else? Uh, that should do it right there. Should do it? All right. Are you going to be at the open mic tonight? I'll be there for a little while. Okay. Like All right. Well. I love how you called it open mic. Yeah, he, open, does, it is. he does open mic comedy. You do comedy? Sign up and you go on stage. Oh, nice. Dude, that would be so cool. Yeah, it would be cool if you did comedy. We, uh, we would like to record you. Go back to your own country, you son of a... Uh, I've heard that one before. This guy is tearing up our basketball goal. So, so far, a lot of the people have actually been really nice to us. I guess that guy was just on something and he just didn't know what was going on. Chandler, you ate all the weenies. I did not. Dude, no, I saw you eat them all. Play me, let's play basketball right now. I'm not gonna play basketball because I don't like sports. Oh, you see that? It's so random, but it looks so dramatic. Delicious. Can I go tell the boys the food is ready? Yeah, weren't they having a fight about food or something? Yeah, I think that's the reason why they're playing. Oh. So, are we all dressed up and ready to go to the party? We are, and we were just thinking that going to this party is the weirdest thing we've ever done. Except for the time we all sat in a circle. Or the time we were in straight jackets in the same asylum. What about the time we counted to 100,000? Uh, that was- No, just that's just you. <laughs> I went to Ohio. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. An old man with a beard came over here and told us there's a party. Wait, an old man told us about the party? Yeah. yeah. Oh, great. It's my kind of party. <laughs> <laughs> we scoped it out with the drone. It looks pretty dope. It was lit up. Yeah. But there was empty seats. Apparently, it was like a show or like an open mic. And there was lights. So, yeah, we're going. <laughs> That's all it takes. We lights. Like lights. Maybe I can't sleep. Wow, the footage is going to be very dark. There's no proper lighting. Mm -hmm. I just signed up for the open mic here, and I'm gonna try to do some stand-up comedy. Uh, if I'm doing bad, just get the car ready. I was actually born in Saudi Arabia. Do you guys know where that is? Yeah. First memory was that all the women there dressed the same. They covered everything except their eyes. My second memory was that I kept losing my mom in retail stores. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Thank you for letting me do this. Appreciate it. That's, that's actually quite good. <laughs> First thing, second thing. I'm gonna listen to the joke again. It's actually quite good. It's actually quite good. I was actually born in Saudi Arabia. Do you guys know where that is? Yeah. yeah. First memory was that all the women there dressed the same. They covered everything except their eyes. My second memory was that I kept losing my mom in retail stores. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Thank you for letting me do this. Appreciate it. <laughs> So 
To be honest, I was not expecting this. There's kind of like a community and everyone here just seems super chill. They were playing a lot of music that I really enjoy and love. I had no clue that something like this was going to be just randomly in the middle of the desert. For a place with no laws, this is actually pretty just chill and uh, it's kind of like a community. Uh, everyone's getting along. Um, I'm just kind of surprised in the middle of the desert you have this. There's a lot of different people out here, you know? This is awesome. I honestly didn't expect this. I didn't want to come here in the first place, but it's crazy. You want to go dance? I'll donate. Heck yeah. Let's go do it. <laughs> All right, boys, I'm staying here. I'm gonna live here. No. Garrett, you wouldn't last five seconds out here. Whoa, right. we've been out here for 24 <laughs> <You're right>. hours. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You wouldn't last five more seconds out here. Yeah, you're right. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Oh, I was right. Oh, Garrett's gone. Yeah. What if three knife guy comes back? What if he literally just popped up right behind you and grabbed you by the throat? Uh, I mean, it's my time to go and get stabbed with three rusty knife. I'm sorry, dude. If you're listening, we don't mean this. I thought I you said you wanted to live here, man. <laughs> yeah, I talked to some of the locals. They denounced three knife man. They don't like him. No, they don't like Chris him. Chris wanted to go up on stage and dance with somebody. I didn't want to go on stage, you liar. But he can't dance, so he chickened out. And now we're making fun of him for it. Wow, great play-by-play. -play. Who are you, Joe Madden? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, you might as well just walk into the abyss after that one. <laughs> Alright, see you guys. I'm out of here. So the boys don't understand how this works. You can't just approach a slab city and, and just be like, yo, dance with me. They have to accept you. you and so he dance. was you don't know if he was vibing with me or not, you just man. Can't dance. You can't dance. Oh God, no. Stop it, man. I honestly don't care if Chris can or can't dance, but I just like making fun of him, so it's really funny that he didn't dance. I'm gonna be honest, Chris is starting to get arrogant, you know, because he built the tents. It happens every time. I was told to talk about how Chris didn't dance. Ha ha, Chris. He won't do it because he can't dance either. Yeah, I know, that's literally what I was thinking. Why would I make fun of him when I can't dance? <laughs> so I'm in the tent, and I'm not gonna lie, I feel exhausted. It's been a pretty fun day. I'm gonna go to bed soon. Hmm. All right, guys, it's been a long day. Uh, I'm pretty tired. Okay, God is telling me to go to sleep. It was a crazy experience, but it's time for bed, so peace out. I think I'm gonna hit the hay. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not feeling too well. I'm gonna go ahead and go to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I am not feeling too good. I'm really sick. I think I need to go to like the doctor or something. You guys look cute spooning together, though. <laughs> But seriously, I'm feeling really bad. I think I might have a fever. Wait, what, what hey, we'll, we'll get you some medicine. We'll get you a doctor. Chris is apparently sick, like even worse now. So we gotta go take him to the doctor. Yeah, I get kidney stones really bad. I've had three within like the last year. Shout out to kidney stones, I guess. We picked up the campsite. We're gonna skirt, skirt out, take care of Chris. So apparently, Chandler, the only thing dangerous about Slab City is Chris's kidney stones. And three knife man. And three knife man. But I think it's here to stay. Well, thank you so much. Hope you enjoyed. Subscribe. Thank you.